So yeah, we're in a we're in a shady alleyway. This is where I do all of my shady transactions. How do you think the Vila's chest gets very full? It's not from like fueling the economy or something. Uh, it's actually because I I, I sell crack. This is de Ezio definitely looks like somebody who would sell crack to you, and and you know, like you can't say no because he has like that pouty face. Don't buy my crack. I'll put a crack in your skull. <laughs> Yeah, I had to sniff up some of the crack, by the way. Uh, I kind of needed to, but whatever. Yeah, you know, Ezio was actually going to knock. What a very polite gentleman for a drug dealer. Coffee? Oh, dude, coffee. That's that's awesome stuff, man. You know, before I started a recording session, I actually drank a cup of coffee. You know, you know, the caffeine, it helps me stay concentrated. And it makes me feel better about myself. I like to refer to it as my confidence juice. There's a very good chance that I might be spiraling into a caffeine addiction. I, I, I cleared out six boxes of K-Cups in like the past three days. And I think I think that's worrisome. Uh, you know, I think I might have a problem. Uh, you know, you know, like, the only way to resolve a problem is to first admit that you have a problem, and that's the hardest step. I might have to go to rehab, guys. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, some, so, so some crazy shit is going on. Oh, man, I could really use some more coffee. <laughs> We're gonna have to get a pen to draw these new plans. Don't worry, Ezio. I'll make sure you get a good job at the bakery. I want to work at the bakery to hone my skills and become a master cake, cake crafter. I will make round cakes and square cakes. I will make all the cakes and I'll make them nice and good. All right, hey Rosa, how's how's it going? You having a having a good day? Well, I had an arrow like stat like impaled into my leg. I don't think I'll be able to walk for the rest of my life. But other than that, like I'm I'm completely okay. I want to learn to climb, so that later tonight, you and I can climb up to the balcony! And I will take you out to a nice Danny's to have all day pancakes, or any other breakfast meal! I, I ship them hardcore right now. I'm pretty sure his hands didn't, like, actually land on the planks. They actually, like, clipped into the walls. Or, you know, just, like, float above the wall. It's kind of kind of weird, but whatever. Also, Ezio's clothes are covered in blood, you know? Like, he, he really needs to take a, a bubble bath in his clothes. It might, it might help get rid of the stains. Uh, you know, it might make the bubbles bloody. But yeah, we just learned a new skill. Uh, we, we just acquired a new skill. It allows us to jump, like, higher so that we can get to higher ground, which is gonna make parkour, like, climbing up buildings, that part specifically, even easier. You know, Rosa is, like, the least uncanny person in the entire game. Like, she and Ezio look very normal. Ironically, Ezio having a pouty face, but she looks freaking normal to me. Like, you know, Lucy Stillman? Like, she she's terrifying. Also, I broke my armor. I mean, it's it's so terrifying, right? That like it actually like it like it, it, it destroys your 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 psychological defenses. Like you you'll never be able to see the world the same way again. You know, I also like how the 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 mood, like the the lighting and atmosphere just, you know, changes colors the second you go into the house. It implies that the house is pleasant, but the outside world, it is a harrowing, oppressive blue. But here, it's a soft and pleasant yellow. Atmosphere is sexy. 
much longer than not. Why the hell is that guy sexy? I was talking about the dude on the left. Ezio, you're nowhere near as sexy. This man is beautiful! Someone should draw a picture of him! Kill the traitors! Kill the traitors who would dare draw silly mustaches on, on, on a man like this! You cannot draw silly mustaches on him, for he already has a regular mustache! And you taint his face. You are... Who, whomever has done this, they, they are a pestilence and, and they will be destroyed. Um... Yeah. Oh shit, we got three triangles. I don't give a shit. You know, it's super cool to find, like, three triangles on a wall, but... You know what? Rooftops are triangles. Alright, now where's the traitor? I have a feeling he's on the ship. I mean, it seems like a place that the traitor would reside. I mean, yeah, all traitors, they stay on ships and they ship other people. Me? I might be a traitor to humanity because I, 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 I ship Ezio and Rosa, like, hard. While people would, like, ship Ezio and his sister. <laughs> uh, believe me, there actually are people who do that. Uh, so, you know what? Okay, where the hell are you? Where art thou, you vile traitor, with your repugnant nose? You might actually have a repugnant nose. Uh, whatever. Where's the traitor? I don't know where he is, and I'm too impatient to look. Where's the traitor? If anybody is a traitor, they better show themselves right now, or I'm gonna- I'm gonna get mad. Oh shit, he's on the bigger ship. Okay, I thought he was on th that ship over there. But nope, of course he'd be on the bigger ship. The, the- 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 the bigger the traitor, the bigger the ship. If you used to be important and then you betray your kind, you're gonna be on a big ship. Avoid detection. Oh, shit. Uh, swimming underwater allows you to break your enemy's line of sight. Wait, am I- am I not allowed to be detected? Or- or can I just go in and just, like, outright kill him? Kill the traitor. It, it doesn't seem like it's resetting. Uh, but you know what? That's a good thing. Uh, so yeah, I'll just, uh, I'll take care of you guys real quick. Uh, I gotta talk to the traitor. I gotta give him a, a proper scolding. I gotta- I gotta, like, you know, scream at him and- and, and exacerbate his worst traits and make him feel bad. Uh, you, you, you have a big ugly nose, sir. Like, that, that, that's no way to get laid. You can do no, you can do, uh, like, you know, like, uh, igloo sex. Uh, is that what I'm calling it? Yeah, you can do igloo sex with that big nose. <sighs> Never mind, you're dead. Like, you know, continuing this bit would essentially be beating a dead horse. Um, alright, next target is over wow that's far um let's let's come over here because you know the tar target number two is in, is a, is in closer range uh i i, I have the, the the traitor in 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 my peripheral vision right now i can't exactly see who it is but i know he's there i know he's there and it turns out that like there wasn't any traitors at all and Ezio's just a crazy madman just killing random people like, what, what if Ezio is actually a crazy psychopath, and, like, everybody, like, is, like, like, everyone he talks to, they're just, like, products of his imagination. Uh, I, that, that actually would be a really super fucked up theory. But too bad there's not enough evidence. Oh, no, and I, ha I had an arrow in my, hey, stop shooting arrows at me! Well, you know what, I can, I can take it. I can, I can take anything you, you, you dish out. Yeah. I, even if it's even if it's imaginary psychopaths telling me to kill babies, I can still take it. I'll still fight the the, the crazy demon voice. I'm I'm being super weird right now. Like even I can be overwhelmed by it sometimes. So you're not you're, you're not alone, viewer. Assuming you're like overwhelmed. All right, all right, dude. I'm I'm, I'm you know, like I'm a, to compensate. I'm gonna overwhelm this dude over here. Stab you in the thigh. That's what you get. Uh, alright, where the fuck is the second dude? Dude number two! Traitor number two! You don't even deserve to be called a dude! You're no longer welcome to the Brotherhood of Dudes! You betrayed us, man! How could you do this to your how could you do this to your dudes, dude? How could you do this to your dudes? Alright, I have zero patience right now, though. Where the fuck is this douchebag? Is he over here? Oh no, that's just a simple bench. Uh 
All right, you know what? I don't know why I hired you. Uh, I'm pretty sure that you're going to come back later at some point. I hope you know parkour because I'm not going to wait up for you. Uh, is he on the rooftops? Is he in my imagination? There's a good chance that he could be in my imagination and I'm not okay. <gasps> I found the traitor. <laughs> Hello, traitor. This is for drawing a silly mustache and a beautiful gentleman. Glitches are fun. <laughs> Alright. Uh, and now, uh, let's just, uh, come over here next. And let's, let's go after, let's go after the next guy. Uh, and then the next guy, and the next guy, and it's just an endless cycle that won't end. Uh, how do, how do we end the cycle? I don't know, Ezio settles down, uh, you know, on the, uh, moves into a farm. Uh, hook, hooks up with Rosa. They, they, they become a happy couple. And, 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 and they cuddle, like, all the time. And, and nothing else. Like, they don't, they don't even have talks. They're not even, like, a normal couple. They just, like, they, they just sit on the couch and, and just cuddle all day. Which is kind of counterproductive. You know. The, the IRS wants to know why they haven't been paying their taxes. <laughs> uh, because we've been sitting on this couch all day, you know, being affectionate towards one another. We're a couple. Yeah, but it shouldn't stop you from paying your taxes, man. Well, taxes, they're just extortion with extra steps. <laughs> what if it is extortion with extra steps? Yeah, it probably is, but fuck it. It's it's the law. Uh, it's the only time where extortion is legal. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, I hope people aren't actually taking me seriously right now. Oh my god, what if people actually are taking me serious right now? I need to have another cup of coffee! Um, alright. So, where's trader number three? Excuse me. Does anyone know where 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 the traitor is? Um, you'll you'll know because he, he smells like a traitor. What a traitor smell like? Utter betrayal. Tears, tears of the people he's betrayed. He uses it as his fucking body spray. Where the fuck is this fuck? Where are you, you fucker? I will fuck you until you are dud. Uh, what if he's- okay, I have a feeling as to where he is. I noticed a glimpse of, like, a gold color aura over somewhere. Oh! You thought I- you thought I wouldn't see you, man. Well, guess what I just did? I saw you! Where the fuck is the traitor? Oh, y y okay, excuse me, do you know where the traitor is? Uh, because I'm pretty sure that he- he smells like the tears of the people he's betrayed. <laughs> oh my god, you're the traitor. How could you do this to your- to your own kin? How, how, da how dare you con convert our brothers and sisters into having silly mustaches on a painting? You know, if you gave them silly mustaches in real life, you would be an irredeemable monster. But whatever. Uh, your, 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 your ass is grass. You have the assiest grass in the world. <laughs> yeah, what? You, you, you watching the Etsy dance? Well, good. I, it, it's, it's nice to have some company. Uh, you know, people watching me as I completely embarrass myself. How about I do it directly in front of you instead? <laughs> the best dance in the entire world. The, the Etsy dance is a classic. Like, you know, if you, if you ever go to, like, a DJ party or something, you do the Etsy dance. It's like, people will immediately like you. So what are we talking about? Uh, they're being held in a prison. Duh! Like, I, I have not even been paying attention to this talk the entire time. I've just been thinking about the Etsy dance. Breakout. Free the captive thieves from Emilio. Emilio! Give me back the thieves! No! They stole things. They're gonna stay in jail. Well, that's just too bad, bitch. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get them back, bro. Oh, and the closest one is, like, right over here. Like, why the hell am I, like, traversing to the farthest one first? Actually, no, wait. I actually wasn't traversing to the far farthest one first. I was actually traversing to the closest one. And it's right over here. Oh, shit. Hey, man. Hey, man. Uh, what, are, what are you doing out here on, on the rooftops? Uh, I'm a sentry. I'm doing my job. Well, that's that's cool. Uh, yeah. Uh, I really would have liked to have a conversation with him. 
you know, but you know, I, I you know what I, I like, I like to just screw things up instead. All right. How am I supposed to do this? Exactly. Like, how am I supposed to rescue these thieves? Am I supposed to be as discreet about this as possible? Or, you know what? What if I just like, you know, chuck knives from like up here at this guy? Uh, knife number one, knife number two. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that that hurt. Morning, restricted area. Uh, I'm gonna open up this door, and you're all going to be free. Feel free to steal the liberties of other people. Ha ha! All right, let's get you back to Ugo. Uh, why is his name Ugo? Uh, I I don't know. He's like he 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 goes into somebody's house and then steals all their stuff. That's why they call him Ugo. It's like you go to the police. To, to file a report that a man named Ugo stole your shit. Uh, so yeah, uh, speaking of Ugo's men, what are you doing down there? Like, I need you alive. I mean, I'm just, just one of you, but, but still, like, you gotta just stop. You gotta stop fucking around, all right? Uh, God damn it. I, I, you, you just gotta make everything difficult. You know what? I should just stab three of you. You know, it would ma make my time, like, significantly more manageable. Great, and now I'm directly in the fight. You know, I wanted to handle this, like, smart and discreetly, but no, you guys just had to be stupid. What, you were trying to steal these guys' wallet? Dude, they're the fucking cops. You don't steal the cops' wallets. You can steal from their wives and kids and their husbands, but not from them. Not at all. Don't you ever try doing stuff like this again. Lesson number one in being an expert thief. Stop being fucking unprofessional. Alright? When it comes to any big score, you essentially gotta you gotta take things professionally. Hey guys, how's it going? I'm not carrying a bunch of wanted fugitives or anything. Uh back to their back back to their base. I'm I am I am a I am a loyal member of society. Uh, uh I, I conform to the to the social standards. I don't, I don't go around and, and, and steal purses from people. I definitely don't work for a guy named Ugo, if that's what you're thinking. Alright, can you do parkour too? Or, or, or are you just like stuck there? Alright, looks like you, you don't know how to... I assume that you're not like the true parkour masters like Ezio Auditore is. Ezio is the true parkour master. Like, what happens if I like just, just go up there without them? Like, nothing is going to happen, right? Nope, nothing is gonna happen. You guys need to get into the circle with me. We need to go into the circle of friendship and and love each other for the rest of our lives. You see, like, when we're stealing from people, we don't have to be hateful. We can be kind and compassionate. We can, we can, we could kidnap a guy, take his wallet, and, and be, but be kind and passionate and say, Hi, I'm just, I'm just taking your wallet, but I just want to let you know that I love you and you're, you're a very good, you're a very good person. Uh, yeah. Yeah, man. Have a, have a good day. I just took your wallet, you fucking whore. <laughs> you see, in, in, in thief culture, it's, it's, it's polite to call somebody a fucking whore. Alright, so what's going on over here? Oh, look, I, I, I have more knives to throw. I got, I got two of them. Okay, yeah. Oh, there we go. So, what's going on? You guys just, uh... Alright, I have an idea. Why don't I just, like, sneak past you and just, uh... Oh, you know what? Fuck it. Fine. I'll just have to... I'm gonna have to do this the old-fashioned way. I'm just gonna have to stab my way to success. But also to be very kind about it. It's, it's, it, it, it is thievery reticate. Hi, you fucking whores. Are you having a great day? As I hope you are. You don't mind if I steal your stuff, do ya? You know, that, that, that mace l looks like it could be sold on Amazon for a high price. Or the dark web for an even higher price. What, what like, uh, do you, uh, do you wanna die? Because, you know, dying is honorable. If you're killed by an honorable thief, that is. I don't know what I'm talking about. I have a warped sense of logic, and I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm beyond saving. I, I, I'm true to my convictions, slash delusions. Also, there's a spear in that, uh, in that, in that cell now. I'm pretty sure it may have, like, jutted someone's eye. Well, that's okay. We're thieves. We can make mistakes just like any other person. Yeah, if we accidentally trip on a rock and get arrested by the police, it's totally okay. It's it's fine. We deserve it. Because we suck at our jobs. Not because we committed a crime, but because we're just that bad at our jobs. Alright, I gotta grab this guy. Dude, let me grab you. Uh, I wanna give you a hug. That, that's what we in, in thief culture like to refer to as a hug. We, 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 we grab you and we slit your throat. 
it's a sign of affection and and, and and it shows that we really care about you i'm i'm not evil really we we i, I just believe in a bigger a, a, a higher purpose i be, i believe that if we if we appeal to uh Sigulu, the the demon thief that we will we will attain eternal beauty in in youth and we can steal for him for the rest of our lives i'm not i'm not i'm not a crazy psychopath i'm just staying true to my convictions that's what the demon god wants me to say to everybody. And where, 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 where are my loyal followers? Okay, we got one over there. We got three of them down there. Are you guys in the middle of a fight? Oh no, you're just parkouring. Okay, that's that's fine. We got we got to go pander to our god now. Uh, see ya. Oh, we got We gotta go. We got We gotta go, guys. I'm like a very impatient person. Oh, you're actually catching up to me rather fast. You see that? You you, you see when you're impatient. You're rewarded with 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 quicker happiness. Like you can't give, you can't have a second to breathe. You gotta, you gotta keep commentating over and over again to appease the thief demon, who is also our, our, our benevolent god. I started this channel to start up a cult, by the way. That's that's the honest truth. <laughs> oh my god! Like what? Well, like oh my god! That's actually a very terrifying prospect. Like like you know, we have like this very influential YouTuber. Who's actually like secretly trying to convert like their viewers into into becoming loyal servants to some death god or something? Uh, but like you know, it's like you know, it takes years for them to accumulate the fan base and uh, and to, and to, and to plant the seeds in people's minds, re reducing them to loyal to being blindly loyal and faithful to them. That would actually be terrifying if that were to like actually happen on YouTube. That would be super horrifying. Uh, whatever. Uh, pretty sure it already happened, ergo the Paul brothers, but, uh, you know, I heard Logan Paul, like, recently quitted doing vlogging. Uh, man, yeah, he, it's, it's just the next step, man. S step two has begun. Uh, he's not only selling Maverick merchandise, but he's fully converted his 11-year-old viewer base into, into, into loyal soldiers for, for his, his army that he will be using to take over the world. The Maverick army, uh, they're gonna dab on the haters and and everyone is going to die. Like they they're, they're going to change the world, they're going to take over. Like they they they're already getting into the government. Like Donald Trump, like he 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 watches Logan Paul blindly and he sends him subliminal messages telling him to do certain things in the White House. Um whatever. All right, I'm just going to keep throwing knives at these guys. Uh so you you okay, yeah, it looks like uh, we have a, a better alternative to just you know knives uh we got dirt oh shit I, I don't have any health left this is fun this is fun but don't worry my 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 my, my demon god will, will keep me safe why the hell is the camera in the cage now i kind of need it out here guys seriously i need i need why is my cameraman locked up uh i don't i don't know you, you know he's the cameraman he's like immune to the plot come on oh god i'm gonna fucking die this is not good this is not good at all. Well, you know, at least I can slowly regenerate health over time. So that's the thing. Uh, oh, shit. You know, that's not going to change the fact that I'm going to die right now. That's not going to be fun. I do not want to, like, and I do not want this episode ending in disaster. God damn it. I do not want this episode ending in disaster. I have to establish the, the demon god into the world and have my 11-year-old followers follow him blindly. <laughs> uh, whatever. Ma Maverick for life. <laughs> Oh uh, shit, dude! Uh, go ah, come on, come on! All right, I know, I know how to handle these guys. I, I can, I can handle them. I'm gonna give you a hug. Uh, you two are gonna get a hug. You are going to face my love. I did not mean to throw you. I meant to cut your throat. I'm a bad thief. I, 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 I deserve to be exiled because I wasn't efficient enough. I should be more efficient. I'm supposed to cut the bread in the center, but it's a little more to the left. All right, so we gotta escort the Thebes back to Ugo. Uh, all right, all right, you go to you go. All right, or Ugo, Ugo to Ugo. Uh, our 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 faithful uh, water boy. He 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 keeps all the Gatorade for us in case we need our electrolytes in our system. He's a very good lad. Uh, I I believe that one day we can promote him to being a more important water boy. And he carries two gallons of Gatorade with him. Ah, oh, man. The more Gatorade, the better. The higher quality existing will be. Uh. 
All right, uh, reduce distance to target. Hey, hey, targets. Hey, hey, valuable targets. I, I need you to stay close to me. All right, especially you over there. Even though I just need one of you to survive, you'll you'll be you'll be serving your, your the thief demon loyally. What was his name again? Did I ever establish a name for him? You ever heard of that movie, uh, where the guy has like, like he he can't form short term memories. He can't remember a single thing, and the entire movie is, like, shown backwards. That's kind of me right now. In about three years, I'm going to remember the name of this demon. Like, and like, even when I edit the video, I'm not even going to remember what, uh, what his name would be. The group you hired is under attack. Oh, no, they're being attacked. That's horrible. Oh, no, it's so, it's so scary. They're, they're getting attacked by a dead guy. That's, that's, that's a shame. All right, let's, all right, all right, guys. Reduce distance to target, but don't worry. We're at our destination, so I don't give a fuck how far we're going because we're already here. I didn't expect you to succeed so quickly. Yeah, it's been like 13 minutes. I, I did a very good job. Come find me later. I've got another job for you. What sort of job? Oh, boy, another job. Ooh, are we going to be selling fish to merchants? That would be fun. Wow, that is the most incredible sight I've ever seen. An ordinary fountain. And it looks like a bowl! You can put Cheerios in this! Wait a second, how deep does this go? Oh, yeah, it goes It goes pretty deep, which means you can put a lot of Cheerios in here. Alright, so we're gonna, you know, do the next mission of Assassin's Creed 2. Uh, I don't give a shit if I'm outside uh, red cape jurisdictions. Uh, I'm going to punch this asshole. That's what you get. Yeah, it, like, it's morally acceptable to punch a minstrel. The fuck are all you looking at? <sighs> Uncultured swine. You know, you know, in my in my society, like, you can punch a minstrel and get away with it because nobody likes them. Like they like they, they consider them subhuman. Uh, you can also steal their money by accident too. It's totally it's totally allowed. All right, Rosa. Uh, but let's let's do the thing. And I wasn't referring to any other thing but climbing. Uh, unless you want to do that specific kind of climbing, I am, I am all right with anything. Uh, I am an open-minded person. I'm, I'm always willing to try new things. Uh, but oh shit, she just disappeared. Well, I, I, I guess that's what I get for trying to play it subtle. You know, I should, I should have just like explicitly said, hey, do you want to just, you know, have sex and get it over with? I know you like your, your leg is like all, like messed up and stuff, but you know what? It's, it's totally cool. Uh, we can improvise. We can we can dress up as uh, Sailor Moon characters. <laughs> oh God, what's wrong with me? All right, so uh, I got like five minutes to climb uh, this this giant tower. I think it's the Santa Maria. I have no idea. Like I I didn't care to look at the uh, the description. Yeah, I didn't I didn't care to look at the, uh, the, the 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 tourist sign before starting the parkour. Oh my God, were you fucking serious? Yeah, all of that effort I made has just been cancelled out. Oh, hi, Rosa. So, well, what, what are you doing over here? Don't ask too many questions. Oh, you selling crack to, uh... The... The Pope? No, the Pope is above crack. I'm, I'm, I'm selling it to, uh... His... His, his, his best friend. I wonder who the Pope's best friend is. It's probably God. I don't really know. But whatever. Uh, I don't have time for this. I gotta climb a tower. I'm sorry. Uh, I have many responsibilities throughout the day, and I'm, I'm, I'm sorry you can't grasp that, you, 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 you idiot. Alright, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be over here. Luckily, I only have five minutes to, to traverse up to the top of this, uh, but whatever. I have an idea, why don't I just, like, blow, like, the last three and a half minutes and just, you know, go to a McDonald's or something. I could climb up to the top of a McDonald's sign, or, or something. Alright, I'm trying to, okay, there we go, and now I do this. And now I do that. You know, like, I could effortlessly get up to the top of a McDonald's sign. Uh, like, Etsy could, like, climb up and say, Hello! We have McGriddle SHIT! <laughs> oh my god, that was, that was so good! <laughs> I am a failure. All right, I got two and a half minutes to climb up to the top of this tower. I'm gonna make very sure that I don't let go this time, okay? Like my 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 fingers, they need to claw into the freaking bricks. 
Okay, and here we go. And I... Wait a second. I got to the top of the tower. Um, wait a moment. I, 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 did, I did the viewpoint. Weren't you supposed to do that? Wait. Uh, oh, am I supposed to go back down to Rosa? That's, that's my guess. Uh, obviously because the indicator is on the ground level. But whatever. I got like a minute and a half... Uh, before I go talk to her. Uh, so why don't I just blow it off and, uh, oh, hey, how's it going? I gotta go become anonymous. I got, like, a minute and a half. So, like, all right, uh, oh, okay, sir, okay, yeah, all right. Yeah, do you want to, like, go to McDonald's or something? We got, like, a minute and a half to spare. Uh, they have all-day McGriddles now. Do they have McGriddles served all day? They did this all-day breakfast thing, but, you know, is that, do they have McGriddle McGriddles? They probably do. You know, I could just research it right now, but I have priorities. I'm, I'm playing a video game. Like, that's like the highest priority right now out of any other priority in the face of existence. <laughs> okay, so uh, now what I need to do is I gotta come back over here. Uh, start the next memory. And of course, this is gonna require me having to cut the recording again. Yay! Now it is time to find my next objective. Uh, but first, uh, does anyone have a towel? Oh, look, I just miraculously became dry. Okay, who needs a towel anyway? I mean, towels are for the weak. Uh, you can just become dry through inexplicable conveniences. Uh, but whatever, we got you. How's it going? Rescuing my brothers was more than just an act of charity, I see. The men you freed will play a vital role in the weeks to come. Mm-hmm. Just ask for their help, and they'll join you. Oh, so I have to, like, go find a group of thieves and then ask them politely to do something? Uh, hey, 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 guys, I, uh, you see those idiots over there? Uh, could you please stab them for me while I sneak on in and stab this other guy? Assassin's Creed in a nutshell. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk around, I'm gonna hire you, and I'm gonna kill this guy. Killing is wrong unless it's a Templar or a minstrel. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm writing down a list of things you want me to do. Um, <laughs> I didn't even write a single thing down. I have no idea what I'm going to do. All right, let's just hope that I, I'm, I can... Let's just hope I'm good at improvising. I, I, I know that's a thing. All right, so I got to loot three chests or, or something. Uh, maybe I should loot four chests just to be very sure. But you know what? I don't give a shit. I'm gonna loot the three chests, and maybe I'll loot the fourth, fourth chest later as, like, a self-imposed challenge. N not not to impress the guy, but, you know, uh, for me. It's an intrinsic goal. Like, it has always been my destiny to steal things. Alright, I'm pretty sure I have to be undetected, though. So we got... Oh, yeah, are they referring to over here? Okay, this is where the next codex page is. Uh, these guys have set up a perimeter around the box. So, uh, yeah... So I have an idea. Uh, go, you see those guys? I need you to, to beat the shit out of them. Especially this guy over here that looks like H3. What's Ethan Klein doing in Renaissance Italy? Uh, 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 questions later. Um, yeah, it's very interesting that, that he actually kind of looked like Ethan Klein. It, it, it's super cool. Yeah, don't, don't you just love coincidences? Hey, do you have anyone else in your army that looks like Ethan Klein? Uh, that, that, that'd be very interesting. Does does he gag on a regular basis? Um, is is he funnier than me? Well, that that is an obvious answer. That's yes, but whatever. Uh, at least I, I have some good clickbait title now. All right, so yeah, we're gonna go hire these thieves. I'm gonna be losing more Fs. Yeah, I'm gonna lose 450 Fs thanks to you idiots. Uh, but whatever, uh, lure you away. Uh, that's right. I need you to I need you to seduce them. Magically, uh, yeah, that's right. You get, well, yeah, run, run, so I can take your shit. La 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 la. What are you looking at? You saw nothing. Keep walking backwards and don't tell anybody. Oh shit! Sorry, I didn't mean to to take your cash. <laughs> yeah, I just love how he just like walks away. <laughs> Uh, or, or, or something, but still, I didn't mean to take his money. I swear to God, I have, like, very slippery hands. They always just appear in somebody's pants pocket. I have to, like, I have to be very meticulous about the way I phrase it because I don't want it to come off as an innuendo. All right, I'm gonna hire you next. Uh, I feel like you're gonna be very important for the wars to come. Uh, we're, we're going to war, people. We're, we're going to war against, uh, 
the ham sandwiches. You know, you know, ham sandwich ham has been used on too many sandwiches. I think it's time that we made a change. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna, we're gonna use bologna and cheese. No more ham and cheese. Those the the, 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 the that's like for the conforms. Don't push me, okay? I don't like being pushed. All right, I'm just gonna like walk over here and yes, I can use the minstrel as a way to distract me. I'm sucking his dick. Don't don't worry about about me. And now I gotta go steal the boat. Uh, there's a boat for me to steal. Uh, now I'm in a restricted area. Uh, but don't worry, uh, we'll, we'll totally be okay as long as there aren't any, uh, posters of me laying around and people will notice that I'm, that I'm here. I don't have any throwing knives, so I'm gonna have to do it the, the old-fashioned way. Uh, I'm gonna have to boop him. Boop? Alright, there, there you go. Nice, nice, good old boop. Booping kills. But it's also... But it can also be used for very pragmatic reasons. And I am, by the way, an incredible pragmatist. Oh, shit. I, sh I need to be much more careful. I need to be a lot more careful. Wait a second. I, I, I can still be detected? Um, okay. Uh, I'm just going to take this boat then. Hey, don't shoot me with arrows. All right. Now I'm just going to take this boat and I'm going to have an inner monologue. And I'm going to think about things. La da dum da dum You know, today was a very, a very interesting day. I, uh... I, I, I stole this boat, I climbed a tower, that I fell off, uh, th th nothing interesting happened, um, I ate a lot of chicken wings today, there's this really delicious chicken wing restaurant that has chicken wings, and I ate a lot of wings today, I, I, I like the dry rubs, uh, how do I get off this boat? I don't know how to get off this boat. I forgot how to get off of the boat. Oh, I'm, I'm just supposed to start running. All right. All right. All right, guys. I got your boat for you. Now, now, where's my, uh, where, where are my chicken wings? I demand chicken wings. I, I need more. They were super delicious, by the way. Whatever. Uh, wait, I thought I was, like, floating for a second. That, that, that would have been super weird. Actually, it would have been super awesome if Ezio was able to, like, to do that. Wait a second. I am now my own buddy. Look at that on the map indicator. Good, good, good old glitches. Glitches are fun. Uh, but what's also fun is ending today's episode. See you in the next one.